hello and welcome to my channel, Dare to Nerd, where today I am reacting to the seventh episode of The Last of Us. All right, well, we left off with Joel seriously injured and on the brink of death. I'm a little, uh, a little anxious about this episode because I feel like I know where it's headed. Now, this show has a habit of adding a lot more to the story than what I know of from the game. So I'm also kind of excited, like, how are they going to present this in this in this series, in this episode? So I'm not going to talk much. We'll just get into it. So without further ado, we shall begin episode seven of The Last of Us Left Behind. That title bodes well. Winter has come. Oh, there's actually like tracks that from a sled. Ooh. Oh, oh the poor horse is like, Whoa! can I get the snow off of me? <laughs> Why? Oh, we're starting right here. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, that hurts. It hurts. It hurts bad. You go. You go. You go north. You go to town. You go. Hell no. She's not leaving you. You kidding me? You know she's too stubborn. Okay, you do gotta actually wrap up that wound, though. Like, that needs more pressure. Oh, buddy! What the- Oh! We're getting her backstory in the military camp? Oh, sh- I don't want to fight about it. Fight about it? You don't fight. Just your friend fights. She's not here anymore, is she? You, man. It was at this moment that he knew he f***ed up. She's gonna start fighting now. There ya. <laughs> Don't bring up dead friends like that, man. You're asking for it. First path. You keep acting like a grunt so you get the life of a grunt. Up at dawn, walk the streets, walk the wall. You eat food, you do jobs, you take orders from your patrol leader, who will probably be Bethany. There's the other path. You follow the rules, you become an officer. I care because no matter what anyone out there says or thinks, we're the only thing holding this all together. If we go down, the people in this zone will starve or murder each other. That much I know. I mean, from what we're getting from him, he does seem like a decent guy, but he is part of a bit of, of a corrupt system. Like When you control the distribution of goods but only the higher-ups get decent food and everyone else gets, as you said, <clears throat> You know, when people don't have access to necessities, like enough food and medicine, to the point where they're turning to crime to get what they need to survive, and then your punishment for any and all crime is execution. Like, that's not a system that's gonna last forever. You're just pushing people to the fireflies. Now, would the people be worse off without Fedra? Probably yes. But that does not negate the fact that it is a corrupt system that can and should be improved. Like, you know there's a problem. You at least have an idea of what that problem is. Let's enforce practices that improve upon the problem. Oh, come on. Uh-uh. You asking to die, fool! <laughs> Ow. Huh? Riley! Where have you been? What the f*** is wrong with you sneaking up on me Seriously. like that? That was a joke, okay? I thought it would work better. Seriously? You almost got shivved. <laughs> I recognize this actress. Who is this? I've seen them before. 
Are you okay? I'm fine. I just ran away for a bit, that's all. If you're going through some sh you're supposed to, I don't know, talk to your best friend about it. Communication. Wait, who gave you the black eye? Tell me where you were. Give me a name and I'll f them up. It was Bethany and I already- Yeah, I was about to say, she already did that. She already done did that. <laughs> she took care of it herself. Come with me for a few hours and have the best night of your life. Oh, no. No. Okay, now say yes. I'm not going anywhere with you. It's great. It's 2 a.m. and in a few hours I have drills where we learn to kill fireflies. It's wild that Ellie is like the more reasonable of the two in this situation. The one that never listens to Joel, is always cussing, always a firecracker, is the one that's going, no, we should follow the rules. <laughs> You're so weird about that. Well, some people are body shy, but that also might have been hinting at she is actually gay. So Ellie is. So maybe that was a subtle hint to that. How many floors? Uh, like two. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> two floors. Seven. Is he dead? Yeah. Is, is this the big surprise? No. No, this this guy wasn't here yesterday. Oh, boy. I think you knew what he was doing. Yeah. Ooh, son of a... What? <laughs> that hysterical laugh when you have your life flashing before your eyes. <laughs> oh, I almost died. I almost died. <laughs> Choke on it, whatever you do. It's great. <laughs> Gotta love that burn. Can I hold your gun? No, it's not a toy. Um, they kind of made me swear not to let other people handle my sidearm. You have to handle my sidearm. Give me your gun. All right, fine. No, oh, this is how accidents happen. It's not a toy. We're on a mission here. Mm. Alright, I'm already loving the music. Parkour! Roof hopping. You better hope that none of those roofs cave in. Ah, so Fedra's not entirely bad. Mm. Fascist dig bags, starving their own population. Uh, fireflies blowing up the storage depot didn't help. Propaganda for Yeah? So you don't bomb stuff anymore? Not when civilians are around. That's propaganda. Yeah. So Riley is definitely looking at the fireflies through rose-colored lenses, for sure. The mall? You out of your f***ing mind? They sealed that place off for a reason. It's full of infected. If it's sealed off, then why isn't it sealed off? That is an excellent question. Why isn't it sealed off? Of course, you know, if by not sealed off you mean there's a hole in the ceiling, I don't think that counts. Jeebus. Just make every noise. All of the noise. Why don't you ring a gong while you're at it? Oh, yeah. oh God. Come on. This is the worst time for her light to be turning off. God, okay. I thought that was some uh, clickers. Okay, this is very cool. Today I'm gonna show you the four wonders of the mall. You plan stuff? <laughs> hmm? This was her first crush, wasn't it? Yee. Yeah. Yee. Yeah. Escalator. Escalator? Go away. No way. Yeah. Check me out, man. This is so cool. So this is the first wonder, right? Uh, yeah, sure. Sure. <laughs> My mom said when the outbreak happened, people started looting until the military shut it down. So. The stuff that's gone is the stuff that people need it the most. Right, so... Sneakers. And not soap. 
<laughs> Boy, you think all the sneakers missing is wild. Imagine if there was a uh, toilet paper store. <laughs> we know that sh would be gone gone. <laughs> Uh-huh. See? Looking at her reflection, fixing her hair. Yeah. Yeah. This was her first crush. You trust me? With my life, apparently. Oh. Well, then give me your hand. Come on. Oh. What? Mm -hmm. No way. Yep. It works. It actually still works. It's gonna really suck when things end badly in this episode. It's setting it up to be just... PAIN! Look, it's so wholesome. They're having so much fun. It's supposed to be the best night of her life, and it was until... dot dot dot. Just, just staring at her. And the f music. The sweet, romantic, magical background music. We could be running things. You could be running things. I turn 17 next month. That's when you get your assignment. You know what Quan gave me? Sewage detail. Mmm, joy. You know, you're the one thing I miss from that place. If that makes a difference. No? A <laughs> <Ooh, little> bit. <laughs> Is that a time machine? <laughs> if only. <laughs> oh, is that the photo booth? Oh, you. Damn, that is expensive for a few little photos. Okay, really? an arcade. That is yeah. dope. This is the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Find Mortal Kombat. Find Mortal Kombat! Play it! Dude. Dude. Is it? Is it? Is it? Is it? Is it? Is it? Yeah! Oh my god, this has gotta be a dream come true for her. You ready? No! I'm... Okay, okay. Joystick. Yeah, you gotta tell her... You gotta figure out how to fight. Ah, oh, there you go, there you go. Finish him! Finish him! Do not finish me! But then you <laughs> to see this. Finish him! Yo, what the heck? <laughs> The problem is, this, yeah, I can see that camera pulling away. Is this where things go get messy because all the noise is going to be drawing attention? Uh-huh. The friggin' dark and creepy. Not the dolls! Don't you frick- Why? Why? We got zombies. We don't need creepy dolls. With a friggin' flickering light. Oh, man. Uh-huh, he waking up. He been asleep for a while, but he's awake now. Great. Yeah, this is where it gets bad. Oh, wait. Wait. Is it tacos? Okay. <laughs> I mean, that would be absolutely dope if that food was still good, but... Nah. <laughs> Is this where you've been staying? Mostly. Ta da! Volume 2. No pun intended. What? <laughs> Where did you get that? Probably a bookstore in there what somewhere. What did the frustrated cannibal do? Lay it on me. He threw up his hands. Okay, um, how does a computer get drunk? 
It takes screenshots. What are screenshots? I don't actually. Oh know. my god. That that hurt. That was like talking to a kid nowadays about the 90s. Ugh. <laughs> Oh, those are bombs. You recruit guarding their stash? We would never use them on you or anywhere ever near you. How would you be able to control that? You would never let them? Right, and you think they're going to listen to you? Yeah. Ellie, I'm leaving! Tonight's my last night in Boston. Ah, so this was all a goodbye. Ah, crap. Ooh, that stings. Yeah, it's your night, last night in Boston. All right, it's your last night anywhere. Ah, come this on. This isn't easy, Ellie. It actually is. You just did it. Goodbye. Ah. All right, but where's, where's the fungus? The fungus among us. Uh, she's going to come back, and then she, the, she, her friend's going to be... Attacked. Yeah, this don't seem. Oh, yep, Run her in. friend was being attacked. Your... This mother. <gasps> Fuck you, man! It got me too. Damn! I should have realized those screams sounded fake. Wow! I done got got. <laughs> I mean, I didn't have them for long, but I had them. I belong to them. And I want that again. You think the fireflies are going to be your new Maybe family? the fireflies aren't what I think they are, but they chose me. Yeah, because they need more recruits. And this music sucks. You little thief. I was <laughs> definitely, mm, probably going to give it back. Uh-huh. <laughs> I mean, that is much better, but also a lot louder. Don't go. Okay. Ah! Whoa, kid! You got guts! Bold move, sister. She doesn't look like she... <laughs> yeah, I about to say. She don't look upset. Oh, and she was gonna stay. She was gonna stay. Fudge. I have been waiting for the other shoe to drop this whole episode. There it is. <laughs> there it is. There's the other shoe. That bit, that. Oh, crap. No, no, no. Oh, and the gun goes flying and she's knocked out. That thing is almost a clicker. It's actually kind of cool. You can see a bit of the transformation from being a runner to a clicker here. Yeah! Way to go, Ellie! Got him! Was she bit? What happened to her? Because I know she doesn't make it. No, 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 no! No! Oh. She thinks she's got, and she got bit. Crap! Why you gotta do this to me? And she, she turns into a zombie, but then Ellie doesn't. That's some. How dare? Well, then we're back to Joel. See, this is why Ellie's not gonna leave Joel, because she already lost her best friend. Yeah, there was nothing she could have done to save Riley before, but she there is something that she can do to save Joel. What are we gonna do? The way I see it, we got two options. You can't see where this is going? Let me help you out. Two paths ahead of you. Father, hmm. it's two minutes. Or two days. We don't give that up. I don't want to give that up. Man, she was thinking of like her whole future and everything. And like finding out 
what she actually, who she actually wants to be as an adult, basically. <laughs> ah, man, did the fuck? Yeah, Riley told her to never give up, so she is not gonna give up. Okay, yeah, that'll work. That will do. Sterilize that crap, but yes, that, yes. Oh. <laughs> Couldn't find, like, a, a leather belt or piece of wood or something for him to bite on? My god. Alright, I gotta admit, I was not expecting an Ellie backstory. I mean, I kind of wondered if they would show exactly what happened when she got bit, but I was expecting it a lot earlier. But I like the placement of this just to showcase like how much Joel means to her, why she's not leaving him and giving up on him, uh, and what she's thinking about while she is trying to save his life. I thought the placement of this backstory was uh, well done. God, that sucks. They, she was gonna stay. And they had their first kiss, and they had this wild, incredible night, and it just, you know, dude. And then we know that her friend ends up turning, and probably Riley was attacking Ellie, and Ellie had to shoot her, is what I imagine probably happened. God, why? And her first crush and her first kiss and the vagina. Ha! Oh, and that also explains why the fireflies found her. Because she was technically in one of their hideouts where they were keeping those bombs and those weapons. So it would make sense that Marlene would go to check up on this new recruit with the bombs and find her new recruit, you know, dead or turned. But Ellie seems perfectly fine. In fact, she's not showing any sign of the infection progressing. So, wow. And why she knew about Riley. Why she knew Riley's name. Because Marlene mentioned Riley before. Ah, oh, God. It's all coming together and it hurts. <laughs> but that's going to do it for this reaction. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like and a comment down below. I would love to hear your thoughts. And I will see you in the next video. Okay, bye!